Hey guys, James here, back with another video. I've been waiting a long time for this day. I've been waiting a long time for this day. This is the unboxing of the 128 gigabyte Space Gray iPod Touch 6 generation. Now, I've been wanting this for a really long time and the day has finally come. And so I'm super excited. I've actually, I actually received this um, about five, not five, four, three or four days ago. But because I haven't had, um, I haven't had the time to unbox it, and I actually, uh, my case literally just came in the mail, so this is the case for it. So I'll do that with this video as well. Pretty much my most viewed video is the iPod Touch um, 6 Gen that I did for my friend Andre. He he got the blue, uh, six, I think 16 or 32 gig, um, and yeah, that seemed to go up, like blow up in in a lot of views. So yeah, this is the 120 gigabyte. So of course. The case, iPod Touch on the side, you've got the stuff on here, you've got the Apple logo on top. At the back, you can see it's the 128 gigabyte version um, and stuff that it includes in this. At the bottom, you've got, you know, uh, designed in Apple California and assembled in China. And that's the model number. Let's get into it. I'm excited. Let's do it. So, just rip. So you don't actually need any like knives or anything. You just peel that off, then it hinges, and you have um, this thing itself. So looking at that, wow, that's so nice. That is so nice. I just love that matte um, metal that Apple have going on. Put that aside. iPod Touch guide. So sleep wake. Uh, you got your. This is in Viet. That's really strange. Okay, so Vietnamese. Um, underneath they've got the English, so that's all right. So English, sleep wake, volume, lightning connector, and home button, more Vietnamese. And um, yeah, your limited warranty and stuff like that. That's so interesting. And then you got your, of course, you got your Apple stickers, of course. Now this is Apple Malaysia. Now, I don't know why, but it says in, in the bottom part, let me just show you again. What does it say? For Malaysia, Apple Malaysia. Now, I don't know why, I got this from an Australian store. I got this in Melbourne, um, for those who know Chadston. I got this at Chadston. So I don't know why it's, it's showing Malaysia, but hopefully I'll be able to use this. I mean, if I can't, that's pretty disappointing. And then what else you get? You get your lightning connector. I'm assuming this is a one meter standard lightning connector. And you have your Apple EarPods. Again, um, no microphone on these. Um, and yeah, I think these are my first real EarPods. I don't actually own any EarPods. So they've changed this in the sense that um, you can't detach these. You used to be able to detach them, but now they just go straight. I think that's a good idea anyway. So this is how I roll up my um, earphones. There you go, so they stay together. And um, the cable. So that's that. I remember how to do this. I was thinking like, how do I do this? You actually have to just remove the sticker. So this is obviously a sticker. You take that off and do that. Wow, that is so nice. That is really nice. Okay, so tour. Um, eyesight camera with just a single flash, it's not dual tone. Um, you have the antenna, sleep wake button as well. That is, oh, that is just so nice. I just can't get over how nice that is. Um, you've got your volume rockers. Um, they're individual, not together. You have your headphone jack, your lightning connector and your speaker grill on this side. There isn't anything. And then you've got iPod touch. And then of course you've got your details, serial number and stuff like that. But wow, that is nice indeed. That is really nice. It feels really nice. And then of course you've got your home button and your eyesight camera here. Now I'll put this aside for a second. Now I'm going to open my case. So this is just a kind of a case that I got from eBay. I'll leave a link in the description for it. It's pretty cheap. Um, just came in this plastic, came in an envelope in this plastic. 
Um, it's pretty much a TPU kind of silicon case. Um, this is the same one that um, my friend got, uh, Andre, for his iPod Touch. So I think this is good. Um, has all the holes necessary and even comes with a free screen protector. This is in tempered glass. I have ordered a tempered glass. It should come probably tomorrow and I'll probably do a video on applying that. Um, but for now, I'm just going to put this straight in because I don't want this to uh, get destroyed in any way. So putting this case on, uh, this is before I even power the device on. That feels really nice, um, really good fit. So it's got all the necessary holes. So for the headphone jack, now you won't be able to fit any fancy um, big thick headphones in there, but that's okay because I don't have any lightning connector as well as your speaker grill. And then you have your two buttons. So this is just one, this is just one button, but you can individually touch them. And of course your iSight camera recessed and for your flash and everything and then your sleep weight button. So let's get straight into it. Let's do the first setup. So I can actually set this up as my own, which is nice. So of course no touch ID. Um, this might not have power in it. That's why it keeps turning on and off. Hmm. All right. Let's see if I can charge this. See, I always thought it we would say like low battery or something. Um, all right. So I've plugged that in. So yeah, I think it, this didn't have any battery in it at all. So I'm just going to have to charge it during this duration which is fine. Let's do that. Oh, it does have battery. I wonder what that was all about. Don't know. All right, English, uh, country. Location services enabled, passcode, let's do zero, 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 zero. I'll just use it, I'll change it later. Um, set up, I'll set up as a new one again for now. Log in. I agree. So it's pretty much similar to the iPad, which I did just not too long ago. But it was very strange how the, the start, it just wouldn't want to start up unless it needed power. Very, very strange. Uh, turn off our cloud drive for now. I pretty much only want to use this for music, um, but I may put a few games on this. Uh, don't restore, continue. I'll turn on Siri. Don't send. Get started. So it's funny because um, it didn't have that Siri um, kind of setup. So if I, what is the weather here today? Here's the weather today. All right, so that's the weather. Um, if I go, hey Siri. So I don't think you can actually activate Siri from voice command. So Siri, and now hey Siri. Okay, you set it up, we can. Let's do that. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. Hey Siri. Hey Siri, how's the weather today? Hey Siri, it's me. There you go, done. Nice. English Australia. Yep. Okay. Cool. 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 Let's see if there's a software update available. Oh, it is. There is a update. So it says preparing update. Maybe I'll just skip that for now. So yeah, this same thing comes with all your same apps. So Keynote, Numbers, Pages, GarageBand, and iMovie. So that's really, really good how they do that out in the box. Some extras, some tips, voice member, contacts, find my friends. Um, you get the calculator, which you don't get on the iPad, which is I find really stupid and weird how you don't have a calculator on your iPad. Um, messages, you've got notes, stocks, all your good stuff um, you've got. 
even health as well. This um, tracks your, your steps and everything. So that's cool. Um, the camera, I've already seen, I've already given a demonstration on the camera, it's the same thing. So to confirm, 114 available. So you lose about 14 gigs and 109, um, so capacity and the 109 available. Version 9.3.2, that's the version you get straight out of the box. And that is the model number. So cool. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, let's see any other features that we can mess with. So here you get the app drawer, on well, the app drawer, but things, the, I don't know what it's called. Um, you can adjust brightness straight out here. You can go to night, or oh, do not disturb, sorry. Orientation lock is here as well. Airplane mode, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, your vol volume for music. You have flashlight, which is nice. That's awesome. Um, what's this? Timer, so that's straight from the bottom as well. You have uh, night shift, so just the color display, oh, okay. So this also has it for the upper touch, which is awesome, which is cool. Uh, so you can turn on when you want it, which is nice. Calculator, of course, is handy to have straight out. And then your camera, of course. So allow. So that's it. Um, now, double tapping does uh, multitasking. So get rid of all these apps. Uh, long press activates Siri. Um, and then your sleep and wake button. Oh, I can install the update now. Let's do that. All right, so finally the installation has finished and so now it's doing a reboot and we'll see what we get. Don't tell me, don't tell me I have to set up all over again. Update complete. Turn off iCloud Drive. Get started. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I try to be a little bit more um, uh, detailed in this video compared to the previous one that I did of my with my friends one. Um, so yeah, hopefully it answers all your questions that you need to know. Um, I think the iPod Touch is still very much alive. Um, I don't think it's dead um, because I'm an Android user and so therefore I need some, and I use iTunes and so I can't really convert my whole library into my phone. And I like the way that the iPod Touch works. I love how the music app has, you know, playlists and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, I think the iPod Touch is very much alive. Great for young people who don't have phones as well. Um, this is pretty much the power of an iPhone 6 right inside here. That's it for this video. Hope you liked it. Like it if you liked it. Dislike if you disliked it. Leave a comment below if you have any questions or any comments. Um, and I'll try to get around to answering those for you as soon as I can. Subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.